Hey everybody, back today with a super quick tutorial on how to make, make a pacifier clip for a little baby. This, sorry my dogs are uh, playing. This part clips to the clothing, it's a suspender clip. Got it on Amazon years ago, but I'm sure that you can find these exact ones or something similar um, with just a quick Google search. And then just ribbon at the other end to hold the binky. So I hope that you enjoy. To do this quick project, you need um, just a little bit of cork and a couple other supplies. So I have 10 inches tall by two inches of the main cork. And this is actually what's gonna be on the bottom of the pacifier clip. And then I have my accent color here, so 0.75 by 10. I have five inches of half inch ribbon. I have one clip, this is called a suspender clip and then it's one inch wide here. You're gonna need a couple rivets and then some clips. So the first thing you're gonna do is fold on your two inch wide piece, fold it in towards the center and line up the long edges and clip the whole length. And then you're gonna lay your accent cork on top, covering up this, line, this um, seam the open seam and you just want to make sure that you're centering the cork the accent color so that you can see the main behind on either either side so do that all the way up and then you're going to take your ribbon and you're going to fold it so where the ends overlap and what I'm gonna do is just put a little bit of glue on it just to hold it in place, but you could just clip it if you want to. So you wanna make sure that the ribbon is not twisted. There we go. And then now what I'm gonna do is slide this raw edge of the ribbon into one of the openings on the cork. I am just gonna put a little bit of glue in here as well. Actually, I'm gonna do it on this side because it lines up nicely. All right, and then so I'm just gonna insert the ribbon about a half an inch so that it's got a little loop sticking out of the end here. And then we're gonna pop over to the machine and stitch all the way around the rectangle here. And I'm gonna stitch just inside the accent cork, one eighth of an inch, and like I said, all the way around, all four edges here. Okay, so when I start stitching, I'm gonna stitch on the side that doesn't have the ribbon coming out. All right, so we've got it stitched all the way around. Sorry, not trying to flash you guys. Um, and then I did double stitch here. I back stitched well over this ribbon because that's where the this is where the binky is going to attach. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna trim down my seam or my uh, threads here. And then I have a little bit of overhang of my accent cord, so I just trim that down. And now the last step that you do is, uh, where's my scissors? There. I'm gonna trim my little corners down here because that's what I always do. And then you just slide it onto the suspender clip. And so the way that you do that is you just stick it through and then pull this side down towards the main color cork and so I am just going to put one rivet in here I'm just gonna kind of eyeball it but I'm gonna put it right here in the center not 
very centered, but. It looks centered on one side, but not the other. There we go. All right, then once you get the hole, you're going to insert the rivet, put the backing on, and then press your rivet into place. And that's it, little binky clips. So this clips to the baby, to their clothing, and then this is to their pacifier. And over time, the cork will wear down and not be so stiff, so it won't, um, yeah, like stand straight up on its own. But yeah, super cute, a sustainable fashion, fashionable item for a baby. How fun. So I hope that you guys enjoyed that super quick tutorial. That's just a fun little gift that you can make for any expected person in your life. And uh, yeah, be sure to like, subscribe, share, pin, um, all the good stuff. I hope that you enjoyed it. I hope that you guys are staying safe out there and be happy and healthy.